Hey guys, it's Crystal Briefs. In this video, I'm going to talk about 442 ranged foul versus 424 ranged foul in Wonder Rallies. If you're an advanced player, you'll know what I'm going to talk about, but if you don't, it might be a revelation to you. By the way, I'm going to start addressing Wonder Rallies more, so if you want to learn about it more, don't forget to subscribe. So when 442 ranged foul and 424 ranged foul collide, what do you expect? Will 442 ranged foul win, or the opposite? Actually, there could be both. When you hear that, you might be like, of course, either is able to win depending on the stats of the rally leads, but that's not what I'm talking about. Let me explain. So when 442 ranged foul and 424 ranged foul crash, the results tend to split into two extremes. Either 442 wins by a significant margin, or vice versa. There tends to be less of a close shave, and let me show you the signature battle report. By the way, camp testing does reflect Wonder Rallies quite accurately and it's a great way to improve your strategic repertoire for Wonder Rallies. So my partner used 442 and I did 424. As you can see, my testing partner has less stats than I do, yet I lost this one by quite a lot. However, I manipulated my comp and stats distribution slightly and I got this result. A huge win. Neither did my opponent nor I changed the hero and familiar setup. I just tampered with the comp, which is 857 in this case and my stat a bit, and we get very different results for similar situations. So what's the difference between these two examples? If you look at both the reports again, the 442 winning one has some ranged survive despite using ranged phalanx. On the other hand, the 424 winning one has all the ranged dead on 442 side. If you can explain what caused the difference, you're an advanced player. But if you can't, don't be concerned because you've got most people in your shoes. So the answer comes with the difference in squad retargeting sequence between the two. They have completely different squad retargeting sequences. If you thought of something like that, you should be proud of yourself. If you didn't, I'm going to make you more proud of yourself from today. And you can check that in the battle movie as always. So let's look at the movie of 442 losing first. here. So you can see that after the blue inf squads, which is 4 to 4 side, destroyed the two red range squad at both ends, they proceeded to attack the red range squad in the middle, and hence the completely wiped out ranged front. However, if you look at the 442 winning report, they've got some range left. Now if you watch the battle movie, it gets clear. Here. Did you see that blue squad with watchers started to flirt with the red squad that came from behind? The imp squad is not attacking the red range squad in the middle anymore. This leads to the 442 range squad in the middle persisting and doing some more damage to 424's cav squads. Also, the 424 blue cav squads are preoccupied by the red ranged squad doing little damage because they're against their counter. So in case of 442 losing, the ranged gets wiped out, whereas some ranged survive in 442 winning. So what actually causes the difference in retargeting sequences? There's actually a fine boundary between the two phenomena and, and the timings of 424 ranged completely dying off and two of the ranged squad at both ends dying in 442. Let me explain using timelines. 
So the timing of 424 range destroyed and the moment of 442's two range squad destroyed are indicated in red and blue respectively. And this is a 40 second battle timeline. So when 424 range troops are dismantled before half the ranged and 442 are destroyed, 442 is bound to win. And the opposite is also true. When 424's ranged have a lot of HP and doesn't go down quickly enough, 424 wins by a large margin. If you want to see what's happening in the movie again, I suggest you go back to earlier part of this video. The timestamp is in the description. So this is why people have used 442 derivatives like 974, 992, 794, 983 in order to play around with these timings. You could imagine increasing ranged count in 442 would increase the lifespan for two of the ranged squads. Increasing inf count would also kill the enemy ranged faster, and they've been really effective as carpeted rallies. However, if you reduce calf count, the 442 derivatives become a lot weaker against inf phalanx. And that's why people have used 875 to better deal with inf phalanx without carpeting while getting slightly disadvantaged since 875 has less ranged. So I think that's enough about 442 ranged foul and 424 ranged foul mystery. I intentionally didn't explain everything on what's happening in the movie because one, that'll make the video so much more painful to watch and two, I want you to check for yourself and take this phenomenon on board. I've got loads more info like this on top of the basics and wonder rallies so if you'd like more of these content I really appreciate you subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching and see you later.